Jesus Christ, if I hear one more fucking asshole bring up that stupid Michael Jackson video, I don't, what are they, are they going to dig him up and arrest him? <laughs> you know, and I, I love when anybody, did you see that thing on Murder Mountain? Did you see the making of a murderer? And you go in there and you listen, you basically, you are watching, you're watching the prosecution's case. That's not how a case works. Then you hear the defense. All right. And I think it's kind of fucked up that you can have something come out about a dead guy and then everybody's just going to be like, all right, now we know definitively that this guy, he, he should be allowed to refute. Moonwalk out of the grave and be like, listen, just because I talk like this and I like castles and have a giant ice cream machine and like 17 doors that lock on the way to my bedroom doesn't mean that I'm fucking a child. He should be able to say that. And not because I think he's innocent. Hey, it, it's, it's for you and me, right? So we get the chance to do that. So someday, you know, somebody can't just say, hey, I saw this guy with his tallywhack and fucking wagging out of his zipper there, right? You have a chance to defend yourself. And with this new fucking bullshit of the internet where they just all due process is thrown out the fucking window, the amount of people that I've seen accused of this Me Too shit and then people just immediately go like, I always knew he was a piece of shit. It's just like you haven't heard... You've, You've heard an accusation. But having said that, having said that, it makes me feel better about the suffering of humanity. Right? Because when you look at human beings suffering, if you're any sort of a human being, it bothers you. All right? But when you see 90% of them on the internet going like, oh, you knew that guy was a piece of shit. At that point, you're like, well, maybe, uh, maybe, maybe they don't need that much food. <laughs> oh, that was just mean, Bill. That was too mean for the morning.